What's up, all my fellow tycoons? It is I, once again, Flak Jack, aka the Flak Attack, all up in your face with another Monopoly Go video. I hope you're all growing your net worth. I'm starting to feel better. I'm on the up and up. The first thing I want to do today is thank you, everybody who's donated to Mandy. We raised over $150 for her. We're still donating money, so if you want to be entered into the Golden Blitz giveaway, the links are in the comment, in the description, directly to her donating. This video today, if you, I'm sure you've already seen this, this video will be nothing new to you. If you're a Monopoly Go fanatic, if you're a Monopoly Go addict, like I am, straight to the fucking veins, you have noticed that the Egyptian Treasures event has finally hit all regions. Now, if you tampered around with it a little bit, you'll notice that is a little like another game. Can you guess what game that is? Another game kind of like the Egyptian Treasure events where you blindly have to hit a spot until you get a little wind of which it is, and then the spots around it. That's right. Battleship. Battleship. The game is in a sense like Battleship where you have quadrants and then you have to guess with the spots and then you correlate where you're going from there. One thing I will say about the Egyptian events or the Egyptian treasure event is do not finish it until your final day because word on the street is all of your extra axes turn to dice. Yeah, a little extra there for you. So the key to this is knowing which pieces you have, knowing the size of those pieces and where to dig for them. Say you have a four star scythe scimitar type thing and you have a whole bunch of little three spot spaces. You know not to trust those as you will see in this video where they won't be because those four piece won't be in the three piece. And if you have a bigger quadrant in the space to choose from always choose in the middle to eliminate most other areas so if you have a nine piece quadrant and you want to go like in the middle of each side so that you can eliminate all the other sides my recording messed up on the first three levels of it so without further ado we'll get right into it egyptian treasures